It is media reports that his aides are on the DCI radar of alleged negotiations of the fake military equipment deal at the Harambe House Annex that have put the Deputy President Dr. William Ruto on the defensive. In a tweet insinuating that he met with former sports CS Rashid Echesa for 23 minutes at his Harambe House Annex, Deputy President William Ruto distanced himself from the scandal saying that the move to link his office to the ongoing investigations is a mere campaign by his political opponents. Ruto, who on Saturday insisted that all those being sought after led by ex-CS Echesa are just scapegoats and that soon the investigations will be directed at him, told the DCI to go for the culprits and leave him alone. A section of leaders have raised their concerns over the matter with TRT member of parliament William Kamket calling for the investigations into the deputy president following the scandal that led to the arrest of the former CS. is just a front. The deal was signed in the office of the deputy president. So the deputy president must be investigated. Ruto not run away. Uh, this matter through uh, political uh, uh, meetings and uh, uh, complain that uh, he's being uh, targeted politically. This has nothing to do with politics. This is criminal. Echesa was arraigned on Friday before JKIA Magistrate Court where he denied forging documents in the fictitious arms deal and was remanded at Muthaiga Police Station until Monday. The police were directed to conduct a search at all his premises. Echesa was also directed to deposit one million shillings police cash bill to secure his freedom. Caleb Ratemo, K24 Newscat.